I'm Dr. Jess Mason, and this is one of my patients who we found to have facial swelling and a gingival abscess. So we're going to drain it. In addition to a standard IND kit, we have a control syringe, 27-gauge needle, viscous lidocaine, lidocaine with epinephrine, and suction. First, take the viscous lidocaine and soak it up with a 4x4. Then pack that into the gingiva in the area of the planned injection and incision. Warn the patient, it's not going to taste very good, but it is better than feeling the poke. You can use this time to draw up the lidocaine with epinephrine. A control syringe allows for easy, single-handed aspiration and injection. It's great if you have them available. Attach a 27-gauge needle, remove the gauze, and now provide a lidocaine injection over the area of the planned incision. An inferior alveolar nerve block is another option. Make a stab incision and suction the fluid. Since you can't see it so well in this video, the injection and incision were right here, right over the area of fluctuance, just like a skin abscess. You can give the patient some gauze if there's persistent oozing until it stops. I also give them something to spit into and let them hold their own suction. 